Well, if, if you missed it, well, I mean, who, who didn't hear this moment across Fayetteville last night? No, Arkansas upsetting number one ranked Auburn. The fans went wild. They stormed the court there. And what a celebration. So much excitement. Alyssa Orange joining us from the Pig Trail Nation team. Alyssa, the problem here, though, is that celebration is going to be a little costly. A, a pretty penny, but a penny <laughs> well spent, if you ask me, Chad. An incredible night last night. The atmosphere was electric like you talk about. I could barely think straight at times because it was so loud. And when you beat the number one team of the country, no surprise, the students and the fans going to storm the court. The price, as you mentioned, Chad, $250,000 fine from the SEC. Now, this is Arkansas's third offense. They were fined $100,000 back when they stormed the field against Texas during football season. But look, this is a once-in-a-lifetime moment. Musselman said in his post-game press conference that the team, the fans, they deserve this. On top of that, we got Eric Musselman to take his shirt off again. What's incredible, though, is how he went from that interview with Alyssa Lang with a shirt on and a sling on to no shirt and a sling celebrating on the court to a shirt back with a sling in his post-game press conference. The students were asking if, if we won, would I take my shirt off? So I said, yeah, I'm going to do it if we win. We took my shirt off and I went back out and wanted to celebrate with the students. I took the sling off, took the shirt off, and then went back out and celebrated. No, I had the sling on. I put the sling back on. And then he took the sling back off, put a shirt back on, put the sling back on, and did press conferences with us. Chad, that is impressive, as was that win over the number one team in the country. Yeah, I don't know what's more impressive, uh, the, the quick changing with the sling or, or the win over the number one team, but uh, glad we have them both.